Hi, I'm Gina from NSK. I'm going to give you an introduction to the NSK Red Band Handpiece and Electric Micromotor. I'll run you through how a Red Band works, how it can be used in place of an air turbine, and using your Red Band with your electric micromotor. Let's take a look at what a Red Band is. A Red Band is a contra-angle handpiece which is made up of a series of drive shafts and internal gearings that transmit a rotary motion at a constant speed and torque from the motor. The red band on the handpiece indicates that it is speed increasing, which basically means that it increases the overall speed. The gear ratio 1 to 5 shows that the handpiece will increase the speed times 5. For example, 40,000 RPM from the motor becomes 200,000 RPM from the handpiece. Red bands use water and air to cool the handpiece and create a mist spray. However, the Z95L has a switch function which allows you to turn the air off. This creates a jet spray that efficiently cools the burr while reducing the spread of aerosols in your practice, making it safer to use in the current environment. Electric micromotors work by the physical behaviour of electromagnetism, which transforms electric energy into mechanical energy in the form of rotation. An electric motor develops torque by alternating the polarity of rotating electromagnets. The internal adductors produce the magnetic field used to generate movement up to 40,000 RPM. Because this micromotor is controlled electronically, the movement is powerful and stable while cutting through different materials. It also allows you to control the speed range. When using a red band together with an electric micromotor, the maximum RPM generated becomes 200,000 RPM. At this speed, the handpiece can cut tooth and restorative materials the same way a high speed does, but with the increased power and torque. This allows you to use the red band to perform a range of procedures, including preparing, removing and finishing restorations, cutting through gold, ceramic and zirconia materials, cutting and preparing tooth structure for restorative, endodontic or surgical procedures, and many more. Why is a red band preferred over air turbines? Due to the nature of the design, dentists feel red band handpieces have a better tactile sensation, which allows a more connected feel to the material they're working with. The internal components in the handpiece transmit micro vibrations to the fingertips of the user, allowing them to visualise the material they are cutting. The constant drive and torque means there is no lagging or stalling when coming into contact with materials, meaning a smoother and faster procedure. Dentists experience less hand fatigue due to the consistent and smooth cutting ability, which allows the handpiece and burr to do the work for them. Procedures become faster and more comfortable for both patient and dentist. When using and maintaining a red band handpiece, it's important to note the following. Never use this handpiece without water. Friction generated by cutting at high speeds creates increased heat and using without water can overheat the handpiece and burr, which can cause burning to the tooth, restorative material or the patient. Although the red band handpiece has increased speed and torque, applying excessive pressure while performing procedures can cause premature damage of the handpiece. This handpiece is a medical device and any repairs need to be performed by a trained handpiece service technician. Do not attempt to disassemble or alter the handpiece in any way. It's important to use the correct burrs which have been rated to a speed of which the handpiece is being used. NSK recommends friction grip burrs with a max length of 25mm that have been rated up to 200,000 RPM. Refer to burr manufacturer's instructions regarding usage and rotation speed. Always ensure your burrs are sharp, as blunt burrs will affect the cutting efficiency. When the procedure has ended, it's important to remove the burr immediately after use and prior to removing the handpiece from the motor. Always process the handpiece immediately after use and follow NSK's reprocessing guides for cleaning, lubricating and sterilisation. For further assistance or to book a demonstration, contact NSK to meet with one of our local product specialists.